Is that a big square? Is that a little square? Hi, I'm Allie Beerman. You can find me at How to Be Happy with Allie B. dot com. I want to just point out something about the universal law of relativity. You see, when we're evaluating something, we don't really know if it's in our highest best interest unless we have something to compare it to. This square. Well, let's see. Is it big or is it little? Compared to that one, it's big. Compared to this one, not so big. That's the biggest one, right? I help people to improve their well-being by getting happy and healthy. Now, sometimes when people want to work with me, they think that it's expensive. Let me tell you something about price. There's something called prevention. When you take care of yourself in prevention, you're saving yourself five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars for every one that you spend because it costs ten times more to cure something. And that's only if a cure exists. It costs at least 10 times more to cure something than it does to prevent it in the first place. And being happy leads to better health and longevity. Sometimes when you're asking for something and you're stating an affirmation and you ask for something you believe will be good for you and you ask for it in so much detail that you miss out on the fact that the universe probably that's something that's even better for you. And the universe might not want to be delivering to you so that good or even the something better because it has something that's the best. So as they say, when one door closes, another door opens. Maybe the door that closed was good. Maybe the one you thought you really wanted was better, but maybe that didn't work out because the universe wanted you to have what's best, what's in your highest and your best interest. Not until you step back when you have a decision to make and compare to the other possibilities, look for them, you'll find them. How do you know how to make the best decision for you? Get them, Ellie Beerman. How to be happy with Allie B. dot com. I will see you next time.